And so what we're talking about today is this word, wastakbara, and was arrogant. His arrogance was the cause as to why he didn't listen to Allah subhanahu, subhanahu wa ta'ala. And he said to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, how can I prostrate to this thing that you made out of clay and you've made me out of fire? It was this arrogance. Okay, so it's an attitude of superiority. You feel superior to others in an overbearing manner. So that's the definition, the dictionary definition. Or in presumptuous claims or assumptions. I think I am better than you. Why aren't you respecting me? Why aren't you sitting below me? Why aren't you kissing my hands? Why are you even talking to me? Do you know who I am? Examples of being arrogant. So you might be bossy. You might be bossing people around. Now, this is different to managing people. So, and this is different to being a parent. You know, when you, when your dad tells you, you know, go clean up your room. Don't tell him, dad, you're being arrogant, man. Your place is in hell. That's not what we're talking about. Your father is the Rabbik and he's giving, he's, um, he's doing tarbiyah. He's raising you. He's teaching you how to be clean. You know, and Allah fatu min al-Iman. Uh, you know, we got this chick that's now grown up into this rooster and you can see, you know, they're swelling their chest out and they're walking like this and they've got this, um, I don't know what they call it in English, but they've got this red thing on top of their head and they're just like, mm, and they walk like this. That's mutakabbir. They're arrogant and there's no other rooster in their house. So, you know, they think they are a god. You know, Pharaoh, for example, when Nabi Musa, alayhi salam, he went to him um, and he said, I will show you the signs so that you can fear Allah. Aba wa stakbara wa kana min al kafi. No, no, that's not, that's Satan. Qala ana rabbukum al a'la. Right? He said, I am your Lord. What are you talking about? I am your God. You should be prostrating to me. Who's this other God you're talking about? Musa, I raised you here. What are you doing? You should be bowing your head to me. That's arrogance. Imam Ali alayhi salam, he has this really nice saying. I'm surprised, like this is overwhelming me. It's like, how can people even be arrogant? Because who are these people? These people who are arrogant yesterday, and he means before they were born, they were nutfa, right? They were this piece of nejis material. They didn't even exist. And when they die, right, they go into the ground and they rot away. They become jifa. Um, and so in between, here we are right now, and we think we are gods. We think, you know, it's like walk around the street and it's like, you know, who are you looking at, man? 